Hey, Boilermakers, we're coming to you today from the Elliott Hall of Music, home to this weekend's commencement ceremonies. Here's what you need to know right now from Purdue University. Purdue will celebrate nearly 11,000 graduates here in the Elliott Hall of Music across eight ceremonies. President Meng Cheng will deliver the keynote speech alongside a student responder. The doors open 90 minutes before each ceremony and tickets are required for entry. Purdue will also award honorary doctorates to Catholic Relief Services CEO Carolyn Wu and Cummins CEO Jennifer Rumsey. Red, white, blue, and gold. Purdue is partnering with USA Swimming and the Indiana Sports Corps to present USA Swimming Live. It's a nine-day fan fest in the heart of downtown Indianapolis during the U.S. Olympic team trials. It will feature a 66-foot replica of the Eiffel Tower, a swim-up bar, concert series, and more during the trials June 15th through the 23rd. Purdue is joining the prestigious Chicago Quantum Exchange. It's an intellectual hub driving U.S. leadership in quantum technologies. Quantum has the potential to help us save energy, speed computation, enhance national security, and innovate healthcare. Check this out. Purdue and Wabash are collaborating on a trailer that powers itself. The trailer recaptures its own electricity from vibrations, heat, and airflow. It's part of a three-year collaboration with an end goal of learning enough to deploy at scale. Pharmacy Dean Eric Barker has been named Purdue's new Vice President for Health Affairs. Barker will oversee all academic health efforts aligning health and life science programs in both West Lafayette and Indianapolis. The move begins July 1st. He will also retain his deanship. Have a great week and congratulations to all of our graduates. As always, Boiler Up!